Olivia need to change spots? I don't know. No, I'm not going to No, Ruby's behind the thing. She's like... It's all Ruby, too. Ruby! Stop it. Oh, well, it's not here. All right. Okay. I don't know why. Uh, Gabby, get in between Dad and me because we need to like have it so it's aesthetic. Oh no! Yeah. Oh my God! <laughs> things that we did last year. But this year, I noticed another trend, a more exciting trend, a fun trend, making predictions of what's going to happen in our next year. And then in January, we can look back at this video and see if it actually is, like if any of them came true. So today's video, we're going to all make predictions of what we think is going to happen in this next year. So remember, it's a long year and everything we say isn't going to, like, we're not saying it's all going to happen. Hey, 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 no, not my pocket. <laughs> Everyone's a little distracted. So, um, not everything's going to happen exactly in January or February or March, but we're going to hopefully predict some things that happen throughout the entire year. So, we're gonna, everybody's going to go through and do a couple predictions. We'll do one each to start. Sam, oh, what do you... My prediction, I'm going to have a new knee. A new knee. So, that is huge. You guys know Sam has been struggling. He has two bad knees. He needs... Uh, knee replacements and he has been really struggling and doing a lot of work to get them to the best that they can be but he just there's not much more he can do to make them better so he thinks he's going to get knee, at least one, at least knee, one knee, new knee and one maybe knee. two all right gabby do you have any predictions i'm turning 16. she's gonna turn 16 this year <laughs> yeah get her driver's license okay Learner's permit, yeah, because in Canada, where we live, you can do that when you're 16. Um, oh, Willow's rolling. I think <laughs> that by the end of 2023, we will have our forever farm. I think, like, probably close to the end, I feel it, I just feel it, we're going to have our forever farm. What do you think? I think she'll stop trying to get treats out of my pocket. You think your foal is going to stop trying to get treats out of your pocket? Do you want to go put her in her stall? No. Is that... Well, I was going to say farm, but farm has been taken. My prediction is Gabby will become a champ this year. This year? Yeah. Oh, I love that prediction. A champ. She's yeah. been a champion a lot of times in her life. So. Trillium champ. A trillium champ. If we do trillium. So, Sam thinks so he, Gabby's going to be a trillium champ this year. That would be an awesome prediction to come true. Gabby, do you have any predictions about your riding? Like, do you think you'll get a new horse this year? Gabby, do you think you'll get a new horse this year? Probably. Do you think, or do you think Chino will come, come around and rally up? I don't think Chino will. You don't think Chino will rally, rally up? So you think you're going to get a new horse this year and he's going to take you to... Are you dying? <laughs> wherever you want to be. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I think... I think I'm going to get a mini. I think Sophie and I are really going to get into the minis. I think we're going to get, I think I'm going to get a new mini. I think in the end, we're going to have four minis. That's my dream. I want four minis. I think we're going to have our own little mini herd. So in this year, by the end of 2023, I think I will get a mini. I don't want to rush in and have like four minis all in a row, but I think I will get a mini, my own little mini. I think when Gabby gets her driving license, we're going to drive around blaring music. So if you think they're going to drive around blaring music, are you doing it for boys? No. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> All right, Sam, what do you think? Do you my, think you'll get a horse? Uh, <laughs> my next prediction is that <laughs> I will teach either Willow or <laughs> My prediction is that either Gracie or Willow will be pulling me in a cart by oh, the end of 2023. I love that. Cart. That's cool. By the end of 2023, we definitely want to do this. 
get into cart training. Uh, and we have a couple of places that we're going to go and get trained for that. And Gabby, do you have anything else? Do you think, do you think you'll go to school this year in September? Probably. Gabby's thinking that she might go to school this year, finish grade 11 and grade 12 um, in school. And I think that would be an awesome opportunity for her. I think that's perfect. Um, I think that we're going to go di a different route with our training, with our horses. I think we're going to go a whole new way. I think Sophie's going to go Western. I think Gabby's going to stick it out with um, her hunters because that's what she loves. I think Sophie's going to fall in love with Western. And I don't think it's just going to be one thing. I think she's going to want to do so many things. Do you think you're going to get a horse this year? Um, maybe. If you could get a horse, what kind of horse would you want? Palomino quarter horse. Palomino quarter horse. Sophie loves quarter horses. And, and palominos. And palominos, but it doesn't matter the color. Predict that Sophie's going to dabble in so many different things. Uh oh, Sophie, go, uh -oh. go, go. Honey, I let oh, you no. go. I predict to get a that there would be a new tractor. <laughs> I agree. Yeah. But maybe a couple. A couple new tractors in 2023. Well, you know what I predict? I predict that Sam is going to teach Gabby to ride the tractors and that Gabby will be tractoring around this little farm or really wherever we prediction. live. What? You know That's a really good prediction. a really good prediction. Yeah. I know how to drive this tractor. Though. You'll be yeah. doing the hay. But thing. you'll be doing the hay. Like, Gabby, I think Gabby would like that, doing hay, cutting hay and, and baling it and all that kind of stuff. I predict, predict that I'm going to teach Billy to lay down. Sophie really wants to teach Willow to lay down. It is a huge thing. She's been working at it, working at it. Just haven't quite figured out the exact right way yet. She wants to be uh, gentle and she wants to do it naturally. So it's been a slow process for her. But anyway, yeah, I believe that that could happen. I predict that we're going to meet a whole lot more people, new people. 2020 really messed up like how many... 2020 really put a damper on our social aspirations and I feel like moving barns and doing more things this summer are going to increase our opportunity to meet new people. So I definitely don't think that I'll get another horse. You, you and you both need other horses. Um, I predict that we'll be making a lot of changes around our farm. Um, I don't think that we will keep every horse that we have now. Do you think that, do you predict that we will sell a horse? I predict Stormy Night will come home this year. I predict oh, it. that's a good prediction. Do you think that's true? Yeah. I think he'll come home this year. I think Stormy Night is coming home this year, you guys. By the end of 2023, I predict Stormy Boy will be home. If Gabby goes back to school this year, next year in September, what what do you think about that? Would you be ready to go back to school? I get the house to myself. <laughs> she gets the house to herself. <laughs> um, actually, I think it would be a great idea for Gabby and Sophie to go to school starting no, in September. We haven't really discussed it fully yet. We don't know what our plans are in that regard, but I, Sophie will be in grade 9 and so Gabby will be in grade 11, so they'll have each other at the school. I think that's... A uh, perfect opportunity. Um, I definitely see a lot of changes this year. I see this year, I feel, will be more changes than any other year ever. I feel like last year was a year of learning, a year of figuring things out, a year of growing stronger within ourselves. And this will be the year of change. This will be the year of change, I feel like. Um, Penny joined in. Penny joined. Do you see who she stands behind, though? Me. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> um. <laughs> She's so cute. She's you can so feel cute. breathing on your neck. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hi, Penny. Um. <laughs> I predict I might have a new truck and trailer by the end of time. Gabby doesn't want the horses near her, and every horse is going to Gabby's head. <laughs> oh my gosh. I predict Dad will train Molly out of her sheep. Yes. I love it. That's what I want to do. If you I saw our it. video yesterday, or if you saw a recent video of ours where I showed you guys that whenever I say bah to Molly, she goes insane. Like she knows what a sheep is, and she's never even been around a sheep before. So. Um, I believe that's a good one. We might have to get a bunch of ducks in order to 
teach her to herd ducks. <laughs> People do that? Yeah. Really? Yeah, they herd ducks. Oh. <laughs> oh, actually, your <laughs> brother has ducks. We can just my brother has ducks. ducks. Yeah, yeah, that would be so fun. Well, I don't know what the future of this little farm holds for us. I do think that this spring, Sam will make some major changes, things that we really need to do. And I think it will make all the difference in our lives. Do you think that? Mm -hmm. right. So comment below and let us know what you guys see happening for us in the next year. I definitely want to do way more outings. We're going to trail ride to the ends of this earth and and um, now that Sam has his truck back, we are gonna start, as soon as the spring happens, we are gonna start, and hopefully Sophie has a horse, hopefully Sophie has a horse really soon so that we can do that. Um, so definitely a lot more outings, a lot more riding with friends, a lot more fun things. I want this year to be about finding our joy. So uh, lots more grandkids stuff and Pranking them. Lots of pranks. I believe that there will be a lot more pranks on this channel. I tried to prank Frankie before. Are you laugh? I know. We're bad at pranks. We all are always like on the lookout for a good prank. So we never get pranked. But I believe that this will be the year that I'm able to prank everybody. Uh, anyway. No. <laughs> it was like, no, you'll never get me. And I've been trying for years. <laughs> Anyway, that is it for that. Uh, that's it for this video. I'm super excited about this next year, and I think that going into a new year and um, and having goals and ideas of things that you want to happen really help to focus your mind and help you create um, those dreams and make them come true. So, this is our predictions video, and let's see how many of them come true we'll meet you guys back here december 31st no we'll meet you guys back here one year from today and we'll see how many of our predictions came true thanks so much for watching don't you know that you're